How you doing, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to my channel, Mike Two Two Zero One One One. Thank you for watching this channel. Thank you for watching for this video. I hope you like it. But first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you my my gaming rig and my rest of my setup. And then by the end of the vid this video, I'm gonna show you what I'll be selling. So whoever's interested, I will tell you more details by the end of this video. But first things first, let's get to start it. Now the case I got right here is a NZXT Switch 810 Black full size tower case. What I love about this case is that NZXT did a case for under $200 and you could do three things to it. You can go even airflow, water cooling, or silent. This is the best case for me that I ever seen for under $200 and still a full size tower case. Now I'm gonna explain. I'm gonna tell you about my motherboard and, and and the rest of the hardware. First thing, this motherboard is an Azeroth Z77 Fatality Professional. Memory right there is Munchkin Black Line, 1600 megahertz, 16 gigabytes of 888-24 voltage with 1.5 volts. Processor right there is an i5 2500K. 4.6 gigahertz. I will clock it too. Now, the CPU wall block I'm using is a Swift Tech Apogee, and the graphic card I got right there is an EVGA GTX 570. What the GPU water block is an EK 580 water block. The sound card I got is a Creative Labs Fatality Professional. Recon 3D. Power supply is a AX850 watt from Corsair. Now the rat I got right here in the bottom is a Swift Tech dual rat. The silent version, not the extreme. Up there to keep my processor nice and cool is my um, XSPC EX360 rat. Now, the hard drive I'm using, mechanical hard drive, is just for storage. Is just a one terabyte Western Digital Black Capital, three gigabyte per second. SSD is my boot up drive. I'm using a Virtuex 4 OZZ. Now, the liquid I'm using, is that concern, this is a Mayhem's Green Mint liquid cooling. The, um, oops, sorry. The reservoir is a uh, bits power with the Swift Tech pump. Now I'm gonna show you what else I got. Excuse me. Now the keyboard I'm using is is the Logitech G510 gaming mouse pad. I'm using the 9HD Steel Series mouse. I'm using is a Steel Series sensor. Now this beautiful headset is my steel series Severia version 2. One thing I love about these steel series headsets in my opinion that's just put away mic. But for me I think steel series always make a very really good headset and very nice quality. Now the mount I'm using right here I want to know is a 24 inch hold up let me get this out of the way is a 24 inch LG monitor Platon W2486L. Now I'm gonna show you the parts while I'm be while I'm gonna be selling the motherboard and um memory. First thing is the memory I'm gonna show you first. This is the Munchkin. This is our main from them because my EVGA board the first time it fried because one of my casts just popped. I don't know why I did that, but it just happened. But so my memory died, so I made it, and they sent me the, this is the Munchkin Red Line, 787, 24, 1.65 volts. Now I'm going to show you the motherboard. Now this is the EVGA C68 FTW for the win edition.
And it still, still comes with the post, the little um, labor thing for the motherboard. Because it still comes with the CD and comes with the book. Now it comes with the set of cables, all the stuff you need. I'll show you. And it also comes a sticker that I didn't use. So you want to put on your case and where you're going to buy this motherboard. By all means, go ahead. Now, more save cables. The little fan, I do have the I.O. This is where you put the fan at the I.O. plate. And I do have SLI. This is a three-way long, long SLI. And this is a tri-SLI bridge. They both all the same. The only difference, this one's a little bit more longer. And I got a two-way. That's a lie. Not been used. Now, I'm going to say this is the best one for last. This is how new the motherboard is. And I'll show you right now. This is how for you can, I can prove to you how new the EVGA 7 this board. Just the board in a second. Brand new motherboard, never been used, never been touched. So whoever's going to use it is going to be one lucky person that's going to use this brand new motherboard. Now this new brand new motherboard has a yellow sticker right here. It's proven to you right there that it's not been touched and it's never been used on my system. I'm just proving to you this is brand new motherboard and I'm going to give you a good deal where I can. I'm selling these two products, the memory and the motherboard, as a combo. So... I would price it at anywhere at $220 to $245. I will take that $245. I'm giving the motherboard that just for that price. If I can negotiate a little bit and see where we can work it out at. But my final price will be $245. I apologize for that. So whoever wants to start negotiating and start making a deal, you know, message me. Anyway, thank you very much for watching my video. Comment, subscribe. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, don't do drugs. Be safe. Thank you for watching my video.